Hey guys, welcome back. In this video, we're going to talk about Gary Young, and he was like Young Living's master blend creator, I guess, <laughs> if you will. Um, the the beautiful thing about Gary Young is in all of the emotional blends that Young Living have to offer, he there was very much a specific focus on helping the individual heal emotionally, which is what's so beautiful about the use of the emotional blends that Young Living make when it comes to chakra balancing. So um, I'm just going to talk now about exactly some things that Gary had to say about the emotional blends and their uses um, from convention that he held back in 2016. Emotions rule, rule the world. Ask ourselves, is my life working or am I fooling myself? Ask our clients, do they find themselves trying to escape? Reflection, do I make excuses for not being where I want to be? Is my life full of deep burning purpose? Do I know what I want in life? Am I fulfilled with what I do? Does my life make a difference? Because whatever you do in this life, do something that will make a difference and you'll leave that behind. Am I a spectator or am I in the driver's seat of life? Am I afraid of success? Am I caught in my own web, a victim of life? You see, it's all about choice. No one can ever take your freedom of thought and choice. There are many ways to travel through life. Be sure to choose one. Don't say, don't set yourself up to say no. I can't, I won't. Don't build walls. You actually might block something you need. Use your past to direct your future. All that goes on in your life from a cold sore from a cold to a sore is an emotion before it manifests as something physical. Much of our emotional disharmony is spiritual. You have the ability to change behavior patterns because the heart has its own intelligence. And the best way to maintain a healthy heart is to be in love. And the best person to be in love with is you. Gary was just profound in his wisdom and understanding of the soul and the emotional processes that human beings struggled with on a daily basis. And so there are these beautiful blends that you're going to be able to utilize when you're looking at chakra balancing. And when you're looking at, you know, offering further support for your clients. We've talked a lot in previous videos about awareness and the importance of a client to have awareness. So these kinds of questions um, that Gary presents are beautiful questions for reflection and you can use that kind of questioning and that line of questioning with essential oils and give you know that um, that ongoing aftercare support where you can say to your client you know maybe if you want to change some things in your life you're going to have to accept them. So I'm going to encourage you to anoint yourself with acceptance oil every day for the next however many days, you know, to bring yourself into that awareness where you're starting to accept where you're at so you can change it. Um, you know, things like that, that there are ways that we can help lend support in that spiritual journey. Um, release was created to release old patterns after accepting them. Gratitude is to help us to be grateful for what we already have so we can attract more. Uh, surrender because emotions are powerful whether they're negative or positive and you can use them to drive you to greatness or drive you to the grave. Common sense was to help us make right decisions. Clarity to determine which patterns we need to change. Forgiveness if your behavior patterns were taught to you. You're going to need to forgive you know, clients as well will need to forgive the people who taught us those negative behavior patterns. Um, you know, clarity and, uh, about changing some patterns can be used in the aura over the first and second chakra. Um, think about surrender, surrendering to the emotion, softening to the heart, gratitude in the heart. Uh, so, you know, there's lots of ways that we can use these beautiful applications. There's also Gary um, advocated for clarity and believe together 
for belief in yourself, your innate inner power, and to help people take responsibility for their choices. Abundance to bring you finance, motivation used on the bottom of the feet to get people going. Present time to help with the burdens of life. Sometimes you yourself or your clients will feel heavy and they're not really sure why and it's sometimes just the heaviness of that energy. Present time is where they can just bring themselves into the moment. Take the burdens of life off for a second. Breathe. So remind themselves that when we believe in ourselves here and now we are the most powerful force in the universe frankincense was always about uplifting our spiritual connection reaching something that higher than ourselves for guidance and it's a beautiful oil to support any one of the chakras envision is wonderful on the third eye to connect past present and future so that you can change your destiny it's why that blend was created think about the power in that guys and gathering on the forehead to help you gather your thoughts. Now that's from the master blend genius, Gary Young, um, what he had to say about those particular emotional blends. I've had personal experiences with many of the blends that are just wonderful. Always check for contraindications to make sure it's safe for you to use any of the blends on any of your clients, but really experiment with these emotional blends when you are using um, you know, whether it's in person or whether you're encouraging your clients online, when you are doing these balances, really, really bring that emotional component to it and you're going to see wonderful, wonderful changes for your clients and yourselves. All right, so hope you enjoyed that little bit of info and I'll see you in the next video.